The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. The given graph shows the relationship between time and height for two hot air balloons. Use the graph to determine the rate of change for balloon A and balloon B and explain the meaning of each rate of change. To determine the rate of change for balloon A, remember that rate of change means the same thing as slope, which can be found using the ratio rise over run between any two points on the line. So we choose two points on the line for balloon A and to get from one point to the next, we go down 50 units, so our rise is negative 50, and we run one unit, so our run is positive 1. Therefore, the rate of change, or slope, or rise over run, is negative 50 over 1. A common mistake is to say that the rise is negative 1 instead of negative 50. But notice that each mark on the y-axis represents 50 units. So we're actually going from 800 to 750, which means that our rise is negative 50. And since the units on the y-axis represent the height of the balloon in feet, and the units on the x-axis represent the time in minutes, we write our rate of change as negative 50 feet over one minute. To determine the rate of change for balloon B, since rate of change means slope or rise over run, we choose two points on the line for balloon B, and to get from one point to the next, we rise 100 units and run 1 unit. So the rate of change, or slope, or rise over run, is 100 over 1. A common mistake is to say that the rise is 2 instead of 100, but notice that each mark on the y-axis represents 50 units. So we're actually going from 400 to 500, so our rise is 100. And since the units on the y-axis represent the height of the balloon in feet, and the units on the x-axis represent the time in minutes, we write our rate of change as 100 feet over one minute. Finally, we're asked to explain the meaning of each rate of change. Since the rate of change of balloon A is negative 50 feet over one minute, this means that balloon A is descending, or falling, at a rate of 50 feet per minute. And since the rate of change of balloon B is positive 100 feet over one minute, this means that balloon B is ascending, or rising, at a rate of 100 feet per minute. 